Sarah Mata is a sophomore exchange student from Spain that's in the U.S. for just one year to improve her English. We are like 100 people like each year, like, you know, like we have 100 in freshmen, 100 sophomore, 100 juniors, and 100 seniors. So here you come in the high school, it's like, wow, how many people there are. Sarah has also made a big impact on the Niqua Valley tennis team and her doubles partner, Charlotte Harland. She's just an overall good person. Like, I know I have like my days, but like, even on her rough days, she's just a really good partner. And she's always super nice. And as you can tell, she's like super funny and loud. So. She's, she's awesome. It's been so much fun. Besides the fact she's skilled, she's just a lot of fun to have around. We, she just makes everybody laugh and we just really enjoy her. We are really going to miss her next year when she's gone. We want her to stay. The USA tennis culture has also helped Sarah, who previously only played singles and didn't play on a team in high school. If you play tennis in Spain, you are alone, yeah. you are like a single, you are not going to have like a group next to you. It's like if you want like to go to a competition, you have to go with your coach. You are not going to the bus and you are not going to, you are not going like to have fun with the bus and the other girls. Sarah and Charlotte are both just sophomores but qualified for state in doubles. Because you've seen the movie, let's go to the state and it's like, that's impossible, right? Like, like that sounds impossible but now I'm going to this and for me it's like so important and a unique experience. Even though they didn't place at state the two did win their opening match and as a team Niqua Valley sent their number one and two singles and doubles teams to state. For NSW I'm Kamen Anchev.